Hi, uh, Phil from parklings.com. I hope you're well today. Now, today I'm in the garden doing some repotting. Now, I didn't get to do that last year because of all of the trouble with the visa situation, but this year that's all sorted and I'm in the garden properly. Uh, but though I couldn't do the work last year, what I did do is buy more stuff. And so I thought one of the things I bought, I'll show you because I was quite impressed by it. Now, that's this. Now it's a 36 super seed tray from Burpee and it's a pop-out reusable seed starting tray. Now I thought it was quite impressive because in the past uh, stuff that I've purchased from greenhouses or whichever they've had these horrible thin plastic pots which after a year two years maybe they just crack they're absolutely useless you throw them into the bin into the landfill and they're no good they don't degrade at all and uh, then you got to buy new pots again. This is exactly what I mean. That's good, but very thin. And there you go. Rubbish. Straight in the bin, straight in the landfill. Not good. Now this one is really solid. Uh, it's got silicon pop-up, which is great. And you can even, to clean it out, you can even put it in the dishwasher so you don't have to muck around cleaning it as well, uh, which is great. Although I don't have a dishwasher at the moment, so it's washed by hand. Oh well. Uh, but what I did is when I opened this up, I found this. Now all of those are actually the numbered seeds there. And uh, all the pockets which have one uh, A to six F. And you'll find also down here, you've got a plantogram. And so all the way down here, one A, B, C, etc. That goes all the way down to six F, which is over here and uh, meant that I could actually do my seeds really easily. Just put this down. There you go. Now this, I'll hold the right way around. There we go. There. So as you can see, they're doing really well. This is a couple of weeks of work here. Now these here need to be uh, potted on. Most of these are absolutely fine. Got a couple here, but I want these ones specifically because they're going to be growing quite a lot of roots and I'll show you where they are. But I need to take them out. Now where are they um, and what are they i don't have any tabs in them that's why you have that thing inside the sheet so on here you've got risen letters and risen numbers so if i go a b c d and one two three four so that's d three and four or three and four d so i'm going to put this down have a look at my wonderful sheet and there we are that's these two here 3d 4d and so down here, 3D, 4D, they are the same thing. They are market more 76 cucumbers. So put that down again so it doesn't blow away. All right, so we'll take it out of the tray here. So there you go. That's the watering tray that comes with. It's very good. And here you can see there, these are the pop-ups. Now, we need to take those two out because as you can see here, there's quite a lot of roots going on. But all you literally do is you push that blue part up and if you watch, up he comes and just grab hold of the leaves and up he comes. So, little tip for you there. Never pick it up by the stalk just in case it snaps. Pick it up by the leaves, the leaves will regrow. No worry about that, but the stem, that's another matter okay so that's all we have to do simple as that literally just put your finger under push it out pull it out nice now i don't have a pot to hand so i'm not going to do that right now but i just wanted to show you how easy that is and such a great product um, now i definitely have to get more of these things and get rid of some of my other stuff that is breaking um, but these things here uh, i think this cost me something like 10 12 dollars something like that probably 12. Um, now they do smaller ones as well 24s and 12s i think but the price is very very you know little difference um so value for money this is the way to go um but just wanted to show you how it is they even give you if you're starting up it's great little instructions as to how to sow seeds so uh it's really impressive you know at it so easy watering it shows you how you can actually water it uh, starting on top or below i'll say definitely water seeds from below and then the water comes up otherwise you could be overdoing it or you could be getting them wet and uh, once they are seedlings if you are getting them wet from on top and you're putting them outdoors you're gonna end up getting them, the leaves burnt so that's no good always water from underneath okay so um yeah it's brilliant 
as I say, this, the trays are great because though you have to wash the bottom half out by hand, the top half, you can go and put it in your dishwasher. So you can be as lazy as you want to clean it. Although for me, at the moment, I don't have a dishwasher. Uh, so uh, I think I'm the dishwasher in this case, so I'll have to actually do it by tap and hand. So there you go. I thought you might want to give this a try. If you don't know about the product already, it's worth having a look for. And uh, I'm going to be using them, maybe even getting some more, I think. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you give it a shot. Let us know how it goes. Really like to know uh, if you put it in the comments in the video. And uh, it'd be brilliant to know how it went on. And uh, if I have any, uh, any problems, I'll let you know. But by the way, it's going here at the moment. You know, I've got this tray and... At the moment, we've got one, two, three, four, there, four, <laughs> which has not yet come through, uh, but uh, they're probably slow starting seeds anyway. There's, oh no, I've got chilies in here, so that's probably the one. Uh, but uh, in fact, there we go, so F4 is one of them. Oh yeah, cone flowers take a little bit longer than your tomatoes and stuff so especially longer than cucumbers so that's not a worry uh finally all i'll just put a couple more seeds in and see how it goes so on that note i'm gonna go before my camera blows off again in the wind because it did just fall over there's this upside down and uh, i do hope you try it i wish you great luck with your gardening year so i'd just like to say goodbye god bless and take care bye bye